About a thousand people filled McMaster University's gym for a high school student robotics competition today. Teams from across the province competed using their science, technology, engineering, and math skills. Julie Sharp was there and joins us. Yes, that's right, Al. The district competition, which was happening all weekend, is one of several events across Ontario held by FIRST Robotics. This is the last competition before Provincials next week in Mississauga, and I can tell you the atmosphere was electric. After months of preparation, 31 teams made up of high school students gathered in the David Braley Athletic Centre gym to show off their hard work. Basically, since January, like early January, January 6th, I think, we meet four times a week, up to like eight hours a day. So we've been preparing for this competition for quite a while. We start in January. The entire season leads up to building, designing, practicing, right? And once it's built, we're constantly upgrading and iterating up until the day before you know we compete. It was all smiles for family, friends, coaches, and teammates as they cheered for each other and the robots. William Neal, program manager for the robotics competition, says the event features six teams competing in each single match. So the tournament is based around a two and a half minute game. 15 seconds at the beginning are autonomous, no human interaction. And the remainder of the game is like a video game in 3D with three robots against three robots. Every match there's a different alliance of three robots on each side. Stony Creek student Balraj Panasar says he's been competing since he was in grade nine. He says this year the competition has stepped up. This year is the game I think is much is the most challenging game we've had in my time on the team because all of the tasks feel important. They're all complicated. And these two competitors who traveled seven hours from Manitoulin Island agree. The difficulty amongst the teams is pretty high. Uh, a lot of these teams are extremely good. Their code is like a top top notch. Out of this world, out of this world. Neil says the robotics program is about much more than bragging rights. It creates this inviting atmosphere where students can achieve their very highest. And it is what offers a niche to many students who don't really have a place to fit in their high schools or in their communities. This is a place for almost anyone to be welcome and to find something to be really helpful with. It's like being at a family reunion almost. I feel like everybody here is so friendly, so close. There's no negative comments. There's nothing like that. Tomorrow, 24 teams will be competing in the playoffs, and next week, the top 80 teams across Ontario will be competing at the Provincials, where about a quarter of the teams will make it down to Houston, Texas for the World Championships.